Hello, my name's James. I'm one of the doctors here. Could I ask your name, please? Alice Smith. And can I ask your date of birth, Alice? 5th of 2nd, 1996. Thank you. I need to do an examination of your knees today. That's going to involve me looking at them, feeling them, and moving them. Does that sound okay with you? That sounds fine. Before we start, can I ask, have you gotten any pain in your knees at all? No. And have you brought anything with you to help you walk, such as walking aids or a walking stick? No. Okay. So Alice, to start off the examination, I'd like you to stand off the bed for me and I'm going to have a look at your knees from the front, the side and behind. Okay. okay. So if you just turn around for me, I'm going to have a look at them from the side. And again, if you just turn around for me, I'm going to have a look at them from behind. Okay, Alice, I'd like you to walk to the wall normally for me, yeah. turn around and walk back. Okay. Okay, thank you. I'm just going to have a quick look at your shoes. Yeah. Okay, you can take a seat on the couch for me now, Alice, and lie back. Yeah. So I'm going to start off by having a look at your knees, and I'm going to feel for the temperature in them. Mm -hmm. If you feel any pain at any point, just let me know. That's fine. Okay, if you just bend your knees now for me, Alice, yeah. keeping your heels on the bed, I'm going to check for the joint lines around the knee. Okay. So I'm just going to straighten okay. this one out slightly. Let me know if you feel any pain at any point, okay? okay. I'm just going to feel behind the knee now, okay? Okay, you can rest this knee down. I'm going to do the same on this side. Again, let me know if you feel any pain at any point. Yeah. Just going to feel behind the knee now, Alice, okay? Okay, and you can rest this knee out. I'm just going to measure just above your knees now, okay, Alice? Okay. Okay, the same on this side. I'm just going to check for any swelling in your knee now, Alice, okay. okay? Again, let me know if you feel any pain or discomfort. I'm going to start on the right leg. Okay, again, I'm just going to check for any more signs of swelling. Are you still comfortable? Yes, I am. Okay, I'm going to get you to do some movements for me now, Alice, okay? okay? So I'd like you to bring your heel into your bottom as far as you can, keeping the heel on the bed for me. Okay. And back out. Okay, can you do the same on this side, bringing the heel into the bottom for me? That's fine. And back out. Okay. I'm going to do those movements for you now, okay? Mm -hmm. If you just help me a little bit, that would be great. Okay. So I'm going to put my hand over your knee, Take it here, and now if you just bring your heel into your bottom for me, and back out, and then your heel into your bottom for me, and back out. I'm going to put my hand underneath the bottom bits of your legs now, yeah. and I'd just like you to relax your legs completely for me. That's fine. I'm going to check the ligaments in your leg now, Alice, okay? So for this, I'd like you to bend both knees up for me, mm -hmm. okay? And I'm going to pull forward and push back on your knees to start okay. off with, okay? 
So I'm just checking for the anterior and posterior cruciate ligaments. Okay, I'm just going to check the ligaments in the side of your knees now, Alice, okay? So I'm just going to take the leg here and I'm just going to apply a bit of stress onto this side, okay? Same on this side, checking for this side. That's fine. Okay. That completes the exam, Alice. Thank you very much. Are you still comfortable? Yes, I am. And you're not in any pain at all? No, I'm not. No. Okay, thank you thank very you. much. Thank you. To complete the examination, you should wash the hands, thank the patient, ensuring that they're still comfortable, and turn to the examiner and present your findings. In this case, you could say, I've just performed an examination of Alice Smith, a 20-year-old lady. I examined her knees. Upon initial inspection, there was no obvious signs of scars, swellings, effusions. There was no obvious asymmetry of the knees. In terms of walking, there was a normal gait. There was normal movement, both active and passive, with a normal range of movement. Upon examination of the ligaments, there was no laxity of the ligaments, both anterior and posterior cruciate ligaments, and medial and lateral collateral ligaments. To complete my examination, I'd like to perform a full neurovascular examination of the lower limb. I'd like to examine the joints above and below, in this case, the hip and the ankle. And I'd like to finish off by requesting imaging, including an X-ray, both anterior, posterior, lateral, skyline and weight bearing views, and if needed, magnetic resonance imaging of the knees. So if you liked the video, we'd really appreciate it if you'd subscribe to our channel by clicking here, like the video and share it with your friends on Facebook and Twitter. Thank you very much for watching.